Howdy y'all, Fuzzy Biker here. It's a pretty exciting day in the old Fuzzy Biker garage. The new Himalayans are available for pre-order in the United States. That means they're gonna be here two weeks, four weeks, hopefully no more than that. Uh, I am gonna hop on one of my motorcycles and run down to Baxter's and see what I can learn about this. But uh, I wanna introduce you guys. This is my Himalayan, I bought this 33 months ago, I did some math. It's got 30,000 miles on it. It's been to, I figured 10 or 11 states. You know, it's, it's been to Arkansas, Missouri, Iowa, Illinois, Minnesota, uh, Nebraska, Kansas. I think I touched Oklahoma with it. Um, I'm not sure if I went to Colorado, maybe not Colorado, but Wyoming, South Dakota. Did I say Nebraska already? <laughs> so it's been to a mess of states, you know, and uh, I'm gonna ride the wheels off of it in the next until I get the new one because I, uh, yeah, I've been arguing with myself about whether I want the new one or not. And I'm, you know, now the days here, I got a call this morning. Hey, Keith, you know they're in, they're on the website. They're on the website. Go to go to uh, RoyalInfield.com. Try BaxterCycle.com too. They might be on there too, uh, but they're available for pre-order now, right now. And uh, anyway, I was, uh, I, I learned that, and I, I, I want one. I just want one. I love this bike. I've got, you know, I've driven this all over. It's done everything I wanted it to do. It's uh, tough, it's reliable, it's so reliable. I've never had any big troubles with this thing. You know, it's, it's, it's filthy dirty. <laughs> and it's just been a great motorcycle, you know? I, uh, I just, you know, the, the new one, I was looking at the specs. I, I have not watched Himalayan videos on purpose. You know, they've been out for, you know, in other countries for what, over a year now or about a year? I have not watched Himalayan videos because I just didn't want to learn about them until, anyway, so I've, I've watched a couple hours worth this morning. And, uh, you know, they've got 200 millimeters of uh, stroke on the front. They've got a 21 inch 90-90 front tire just like this has. They've got about the same amount of ground clearance, maybe a little more. They've got a slightly bigger 17 inch tire on the back. This is a 17 also. Seat height is... The tallest seat height is 845 millimeters, I think, which is about 33 inches just over. Well, that's what I have on mine. I raised my seat by an inch and a half. So, you know, it's got a little bit bigger gas tank. It's a four and a half gallon, I think, instead of a four. And uh, it's got an electronics package, a real modern electronics package, finally, you know, as compared to this antiquated uh, system that I've got here. You know, that worked well. It really worked well. You know, 33 months I used that and it did, it did me right. But uh, it's going to be neat to see one with, uh, I'm just, I'm so excited. I'm just so excited. You know, Royal Enfield is a great brand. I'm a true believer in that. And, uh, you know, I've got 30,000 on that. I've got over 10,000 on that one. I've got 85 or 600 on that one. Um, you know what? I'm going to run to Baxter's and, I'll, and we'll continue this chat. Wahoo. All righty. I just talked to uh, Jeremy here at Baxter Cycle in the mighty mini Cropless of Marnie, Iowa. And this is the only new... Royal Enfield Himalayan that they have, the 411 model that they have on the floor or anywhere on the uh, that they own. They do have one more of the 411s coming in. One more, they, they got it ordered. It's the last one uh, they think they're, they they're going to be able to get. And uh, so, you know, it's this one, which is the FE model, the uh, fuzzy biker edition. I mean, the final edition, we know we put all the carbon on it and uh, you know, we, we did all the tail tidy and the special bar on the back and special pipe and, you know, all that carbon and crash crash bars and I don't know what else we did. Different handlebars, I think, and these high-end mirrors and all that neat stuff. Look at this carbon fiber front. So, they're down to, <laughs> that's it, that's it. Uh, they're going to have, uh, you, you can order new ones. Now, contact Baxter Cycle. They are told that the delivery date, the expected delivery date, is the first week of September. They're hoping it's before that. They're hoping it's you know the end of August. I'm hoping it's you know two weeks from now. But good luck, right? But uh, so, what do you guys think? Are you going to trade in your 411s? Are you, are you if you own a 411, are you going to trade it in for a you know your your solid as a rock 411 air cooled, 24 horsepower hot rod? Are you going to trade that in for a 40 horsepower liquid cooled? Brand new Royal Enfield 452, because <laughs> that's the dilemma. That's where I'm at. That's kind of where I'm at on this whole thing. And uh, I'm, I just told them I wanted one. So, uh, you know, I'm on that list, that magic list. Uh, right now they can just pre-order. So they will only ship pre-ordered motorcycles at this point. So 
if you want one, get on that list right now, I guess. Go to BaxterCycle.com, talk to Jeremy or Mark, they can help you out. But uh, anyway, so yeah, this is the last one on site and they have one more coming. Now these are scrams, these are also Himalayans, but these are the scram model. Now I don't know what the story is going to be on these. I don't know if they're going to keep getting these, I don't know. You know, these are all three new bikes, so I'm not sure what's going to happen there. That's a uh, pretty exciting times if you're a Himalayan, you know, rider. I, uh, you know, I, I, I love my Himalayan. I, I have done, the longest day I did on it was a 644 mile day in one day. I drove it through Kansas City on that day, uh, you know, 80 miles an hour. I've uh, had just so much fun on that bike. It, it's, it's really kind of a, I don't want to say bittersweet, but uh, you know, it, it's, it's, uh, I've, I've really grown attached. That's the funnest single motorcycle I've ever owned. I keep telling everybody I've had at least 60 motorcycles, probably more than that, but uh, you know, so I, I think it's a heck of a bike. And uh, like I said, are you, if you have one, are you thinking of trading it off? If you were to buy a new one, would you want the 411 model or the, uh, or the new, you know, 452? I, uh, I'm hoping that uh, the new 452 is something I can do a little more interstate on. Um, I'm hoping it's the kind of thing that'll, you know, be smoother and a little better riding. Not that there was anything wrong with the ride on these. They actually worked really well. So, you know, it's, it's, it's going to be a just, I'm, I'm rambling, aren't I? <laughs> anyway, if y'all are interested in a newer used Royal Enfield Himalayan, Triumph classic British bike of any type, you know, get yourself over here to Baxter Cycle. They've got parts and accessories and shirts and seats and you know jackets and all you know boots and gloves and you know awesome road gear and you know just all kinds of stuff they got a wall of helmets you can't see it back there but it's way back there just a wall of helmets and uh get yourself over here and uh or go to baxtercycle.com tell those fine folks that fuzzy biker sent you a very excited fuzzy biker life is good my friends life is good get out there and ride Life is grand. Wahoo! Yippee-yay-yay! Yippee-yay-yo! Down the road we go! Beautiful, beautiful machine! Hot dang.